Year 2 Works For You Weather, sponsored by Executive Homes. Clear and crisp conditions out there this morning. We're taking a live look on our Brookside camera. This is right outside of our KGRH studios in all part of our day's Claremore RV weather camera network. Nice and clear conditions throughout the overnight hours, allowing those overnight lows once again to fall into the 40s throughout multiple locations throughout northeastern Oklahoma. Check out Bartlesville, 39 degrees, going to be our cool spot on the map. Us here in Tulsa, sitting at that 50 degree mark. McAllister at 45. Bristow staying cool at 40. Dew points are in those 30s and 40s as well, meaning that the air in place quite dry. So well below that comfortable range for today. You may also notice that you may find yourself grabbing that chapstick as you head out the door along with that jacket, cool and dry. That's the forecast for this morning. Heading into this afternoon, going to be warming up with all that sunshine on the way. This is our water vapor imagery. I mean, look at all this dry air that's impacting the state of Oklahoma. We will slowly but surely see um, that humidity increase as we head into later on this week. but really a dry forecast in play for us as we see the next several days not really looking at anything in terms of rainfall. Uh, Monday planner looking at sunny skies throughout the afternoon. Clear skies by this evening. Really comfortable temperatures. I mean, sunny in 75. Can't ask for much better than that. 63 degrees by 9 p.m. today. So going to be just an absolutely beautiful day to be outdoors. Tracking the tropics, things aren't so pleasant. Look at this. We have two storms that we are watching right now. We have tropical storm gamma and tropical depression 26 if this develops that will be delta but look at this we have gamma that is expected to make a little loop-de-loop -loop off the yucatan peninsula and then head back into the gulf of mexico and then tropical depression 26 could be a major hurricane as we head into the end of this week looking at 105 mile per hour sustained winds putting it at a category two hurricane as we head into our early thursday morning making landfall right along the coast of louisiana as we head into our early Friday morning. So again, this is quite far out, but definitely something that will be impacting the United States as we head into this upcoming week. Taking a look at our seven day forecast here. We see that big warm up in place. 87 for our Wednesday. The heat's going to be back. Cool temperatures not lasting for much longer.